Uh, before we go into the word this morning, uh, I want to share with you a, a little bit of <laughs> uh, news that is very heavy on my heart this morning. Uh, one of our attendees, uh, Janet uh, Camuso, uh, passed away two days ago very suddenly. Uh, and it's, uh, it's difficult uh, as, as a pastor to experience uh, loss in, in such a way, but also for our congregation. She, she had been plugging into our church family. Uh, she signed up for the membership class. She actually signed up for uh, the Blessed Companion small group that's beginning next week. Uh, she was very much involved with our VBS ministries as well. She had a servant's heart uh, who served in many different areas uh, of our church family. Um, so at this time, uh, could we uh, gather our hearts to pray uh, for the family and for the friends of, of Janet? Let us pray. Lord, we we are grieving the loss of a loved one. But Jesus, you, you experienced grief and you also wept. But at the same time, we find hope in the words that blessed are those who mourn, for they shall be comforted. We pray that we would mourn, not without hope, but with the hope that we have in you. Also, Father, would you help us to recognize the brevity of life? Tomorrow is promised to none that today we would live our best for your glory, for your name, for your joy, that we would cherish those around us with the love of Christ, and that we would glorify you in everything that we do. We pray uh, for Janet's family members, relatives, and, and friends, also for your comfort upon this congregation, that you would help us to move forward in the direction you're calling us to. For what Janet is seeing now and experiencing now, uh, she would want us to continue to glorify you and to worship you. So Father, we recognize the grief, but we also embrace your grace. So we worship you, and may our hearts not be disheartened, but be encouraged the love of Christ. We pray for all of the details to fall into place, and it's in Jesus' name we pray these things. Amen. A true family rejoices together, and a true family is able to grieve together in these times, and uh, we have so much strength in the family of God. Amen? Uh, yeah, so when more details come my way, uh, I will let you know. Amen.